So this is a diagram of my setup right now. This is the building I live in, and my apartment is here in the middle, and that's me sitting working at my desk. And I have my Tesla coil up on the roof, and down here I have this the copper rod in the ground. So there's one wire going straight up to the Tesla coil, and the second wire coming down to my room, and then this the third wire coming back down to the copper rod. So this is not a very good setup but I was just doing it this way because it's a winter outside and I wanted to work inside where it's warm and now I'm just playing around with my circuit so right here I have four germanium diodes okay and these just four germanium diodes making a diode bridge and you can see over here we have about seven seven point five milliamps and the voltage is about nine nine volts nine point five volts okay so now over here this is the same thing this is also just four germanium diodes but I have also these four capacitors here so we'll see what the difference is I'm switching over my ground wire switching over my antenna here's the negative and here's the positive so you can see we're getting a lot more volts that's 40 it's about 40 volts right there okay we're getting 40 volts with this circuit but the current is much less much less the current is about 1.8 milliamps okay and now I have a one more circuit which is just a normal diode bridge but this diode bridge is made out of four of these high-speed MUR diodes so I'm gonna show you this this is the best one so far we've got this is our antenna wire going up and we've got our ground wire coming down here's our positive lead which should be over here And here is our negative lead, which is over here. And you can see we're getting a lot more current. Okay, we're back up to our six or seven milliamps. And we got the voltage of 15. 15 volts so there you go that one's a pretty good one and we're going to keep on experimenting